he would have struggled converting that basket. But, and he actually gives Louisville something as Wara is able, he comes up with the ball, takes it all the way in on Johnson, gets it up and off the glass and good. And Wara, another steal. This time he's got King if he wants it, but he takes it all the way himself. My goodness, and fouled by Blackman. Jordan Wara with the steal. And the Ennis is able to make his first free throw of the season, and the Jaguars bring a little bit of pressure, and Chris Mack was adamant after the game the other night. Another basket and another shot for a three-point play for Jordan Wara. This is everything, and Sadler with the four, so plenty of foul trouble for Sean Woods in the first half. Perry the lob to Wara! Goodness, he throws it down. What a first half for Jordan Wara. Deep three from Jordan Wara, his first three points in the second half. Overall, and a pretty impressive start here to his Louisville career as he follows David Padgett's interim stint to Enoch slams one home inside. <laughs> you see, Wildy Moth got a little. This is the second three of the year in five tries. It's three for five. And now a takeaway, turnover, Wara. 2-0 Louisville. Yeah, we talked about it. Lee Simmons steals, and that's a, that was a risky pass. Bisons. Early on, though, it's been all Jordan Wara. He's filled up Louisville's score sheet early. Let him go. Oh, Casey Alexander's going to let them go one more possession. Perry forces the turnover. Jordan Wara, another dunk in transition. It's not Quan Four's shot, and if you look back, if we saw a replay of that, Quan Four actually had an open shot to the basket there as Jordan Wara gets the steal and the bucket. Hero for three. Now time for Louisville. Wara slams it home. It's the Yum Center. The early shot displeasing Coach Cal. Wara with a slack on the post, and Enoch not used to that. He's a mountain. Every time there's a ball reversal, Reed Travis is going to duck in. Oh, oh! The answer from Wara. Terrific pass by Emmanuel quickly. A little bit of an end. Miss there, and it's Cardinal Ball. You know, Jay, you've been talking about Hero. We've been talking about Hero and P.J. Washington as he gives up a three-point play. Cunningham to inbound. Wara gets the bounce and the chance for a three-point play. Jeffrey said, well, coach, he just started laughing at him. The moment he called, re referred to him as coach. That's a nice little cut and slip to open the second half by Kristen Cunningham. Wara, whoa, what a shot. 70% in the second half, keyed by a long jump. From the opening tip and i think north carolina was going to maybe thought they were going to ease their way into this game maybe they thought it was going to be a little bit easier but it has been an absolute fight in war the leading scorer for the cardinals on the season has three made threes check for chris max yeah louisville's done everything right in this game and i think the player of the game has been dwayne sutton you know, jordan mora is hitting 60 percent of his shots in conference play on the board for the first time to Break the tie. And right like that, a lead change because Jordan Warren's got seven. The mentality of understanding and moving on. In other words, process what happened, whether it's Pittsburgh or Chapel Hill. Use it to your advantage and move on, like Jordan Warren has tonight. Big win Saturday night, the Carrier Dome, G-Man. Here's Chapman off the deflection, and Jordan had it blocked by Warren. Cunningham on the drive, in traffic. Warren's had the big night, a career high, and adds to it. Ball turnovers that have saved them, and then uh, the good find by Cunningham on that play. On the floor, he was dinged in the Cardinals' win on Wednesday. Wara fakes it, takes oh, it, and slams it in. Well, one of the good things about being a sh uh, shot maker is that you're going to have the defense is going to come out. Of course, we discussed early how important transition would be both ways. Fast break points, 17-0 as War gets two more. Let's play. Moore fell asleep, allowing War to be able to slide in between. Dorn dives for it. Four gets it into the corner, cutting him for three. 
Laura trying to clean up the mess, and he's fouled. Desperately trying to get something going, and uh, that, that air ball actually worked. Cunningham directing some traffic. Alley oop! Oh, oh my! Oh! Time there. How about Christian Cunningham with a no look to be able to get Jordan Ward for the explosive slam? You see, great setup by Cunningham. Everyone thinking that they're not playing, and he goes in to finish it. Louisville off to a 9-11-5 run. McGowan's. Davis to the bucket without the basketball. Two on one. Wara does it himself. Basket and foul against Johnson. Shot clock at four. Cunningham. Wara trying to beat that shot clock. It's a three from the corner for Wara and 17 points. Right inside, great position from Garrison Brooks. Just can't finish. Wara finds Cunningham at the basket and the troubles at the rim persist. Wara still looking to find his. Still sitting at five points. So why not try it out? There you go. Flex down to six. Shot clock at ten. And their best player goes to the bucket. Jordan Wara right down the lane. This guy, you want the ball in his hands. Cunningham. He finds the right people at the right time. What Back a nice door cut to Wara. He finds the right people at the right time. 2.8 to 1. Oh, that's beautiful basketball. That's terrific. That's beautiful basketball. For him has not been rough for Jordan Wara, who's pushing it into the front court. Quan 4 2. Why did you go, you know, the soft route and put gloves on? Is really the question I'm asking. No, it, was a, it was a sucker punch because he punched a sucker <laughs> sitting next to him. That was goaltending. Yeah, that was very close. It may have actually, I got to go, I got to take it back. That was a great no call by Ted Valentine. I want my team wasting a lot of time. I want to see if we can get a good shot early, stay aggressive. And we're on the cut to the basket, dunks it and one. Right on time and Wara, who hasn't been able to get it going from beyond the three-point arc. Gotta get it in, he gave it up, and it's rejected by Wall as the horn expires. The missed shot from Newman ends the game. Wall, who's able to run the baseline, the turnover of Ward, give him credit, comes in and makes a big block on the shot. Stay on the floor along, just enough to check it out, and he got up pretty quickly. Seven points now for Hunter as Wara fires the knees all right, G-Man. Jay Huff, now he's got eight. Three seconds in the half. Wara takes it, banks it in! Wow! Well, and then, uh, you know, they build it back to a 10-point lead, but this, uh, this Virginia team is a very tough road team. A physical ball club. I'm not sure they can still handle that. They got knocked out last year by Florida State. They lost this year to Tennessee, who's a physical club.